Hello everyone and welcome back to another Instant Influencer Thoughts video. If this is your first time here, go ahead and click the big red subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up because I promise you're going to love it. Also, if you haven't seen Wednesday's video, go back and watch it. Some things are going to change. So, there's still going to be a video on Wednesdays, but starting this coming Wednesday... It's just going to be my channel. So no more Nelly and Eddie. The new channel name is going to be called, drum roll please, Nellyville. Nellyville. Okay, so same place. It's, the, it's going to be the same actual channel, but the name is going to change. So turn on your post notifications so you get notified when the new video goes up. But don't be alarmed when you see Nellyville instead of Nelly and Eddie. Anyways, more about that in last week's video. Let's get into what we came here for, which is instant influencer. Okay, so what do, what do we think about who got voted off? Miss Indigo is gone, honey. Gone. Christian Indigo, you did great. That was a great look. You have some really strong looks just in general, so we hope to see more from you right along with Miss Brittany. Now, I will say I agree with Indigo going home because, because, you know, really, it doesn't have too much to do with the makeup look. I mean, it, the makeup look was okay. Was the weakest? I could see why it would be the weakest. I could see why people will argue that that wasn't the weakest look. But why I would say I'm okay with him going home um, you know, you do petty stuff, you're kind of, you, you know, going to get petty consequences. You know what I'm saying? And when I say petty things, this is what I'm referring to. What wig do you think you guys are going to go for? I'm going for the pink one. Me too. It's going to compliment the idea I have. Same. I'm sorry, Benny, but I'm getting that pink wig. Okay, so there was a, a, a just kind of a little tiff between Indigo and Benny over this pink wig. And... It was the cutest one. I mean, you know. But, you know, was it a big deal? No, it's a competition. It's all fun and games. But I do feel like a little bit in the goal is being a little petty. Woo! Wig snatched. Literally. Sorry, Benny. Now, was there editing done to make it seem like it was a little more dramatic than it actually was? Yeah, sure, of course. But if you do petty things, you're going to get petty things that come back on you. So that's just, that's just the tea, honey. Now, on the other side of that, Benny, you know, look, Benny is 18. Benny responded like an 18-year-old, or is he 19? He's young, is the point. You know, I get that you wanted the wig, and you felt like, why would you take it? I wanted it. I mean, you know, look, if, if you can't let the competition get to you. And I feel like, you know, Benny, you could have lost it if you would have let that really get in your head like that. I get that you, you know, feelings were kind of hurt. You were a little salty because he took your wig, honey, you know, but. Girl, I'm really pissed off. I'm sorry, but I really am. Why? What's up? I was going for that wig. Because Indigo took the wig, I have to change my look and modify it. This is horrible. It's a wig. You know, it, that's it's part of being a makeup artist. You got you got to be able to think of on the spot. It's a, that's part of being a big. <laughs> so yeah, I get why that was annoying, but don't let the competition see you sweat. Cause see, Miss Indigo got a little too much enjoyment out of snatching that wig from you. But it did it pay off in the end? No. So you know, really overall though, I have to say, as far as the the drag looks. Now look, I don't know much about makeup clearly let alone drag that's a whole other category that i won't pretend like i know about but from what i the little bit that i do know and from the looks that i saw no one really to me had like a true drag look they got pretty close but no one was really like and that, and that's a hard technique to to really conquer and to really master and i think most of them if not all of them have never really done drag before. The only one I think had the most experience was Ashley. And to me, Ashley's look, while it was a very strong look, I don't think that it was, I, I don't know if I would call that a drag look. It was je definitely a transformation. It was definitely extraterrestrial, alien, otherworldly. But was it, was it drag? I don't know. And also, I feel like Ashley could have maybe utilized Trixie Mattel. Uh, Trixie, Trixie Mattel was the guest judge. 
I just got chills. Uh, for this week, and oh my gosh, Tracy just brought the energy, but we'll, we'll get on that in a second. I think that Ashley could have utilized Trixie a little bit more. I, I mean, I know that you know you guys are under a time constraint. You wanted to hurry and, and, and get started, and the advice that you allowed Trixie to give you, Ashley, I know that you took it and you used it. Do you have any other questions? No, I, I want to get started. You. I'm like, I want to keep going, but I will like. You're gonna be great. I, I don't know. I mean, again, can we blame it on editing? I mean, maybe, but I'm, I'm sorry. I'm still with the my opinion that I had last week that I just kind of feel like as she kind of comes off as this, humble yourself, sweetie, humble yourself. You know, she's great. And when you're that great, it's kind of hard to, you know, but yeah, maybe just be a little warmer, maybe be a little more humble, maybe, you know, but Look, at the end of the day, she had an idea. She executed well, and it was, it was great. I just don't know if anybody really had a drag, drag. transformation. But yeah, other than that, everybody was stunning. Definitely stunning. So that much I, I, I can say. Now, back to Trixie and Mattel. I loved having Trixie on the show. What a great judge. She brought the energy. She had the, I mean, of course, looked fabulous per usual. But, oh, it just the energy and her joke, her commentary, her jokes and commentary. It was... Bye. If it makes you feel better, I'm going home today, too. <laughs> it's crazy that he's oh. choosing to do a sad look when every day I put on makeup to cover a sad look. <laughs> this is your 10-minute time call. Ooh. And not a drag queen 10 minutes, which is 40 minutes. This is the real thing. Great. Two out of two. Last week, we had Paris Hilton. Now we had Trixie. Next week, who knows? But so far, so good with the judge selection, um, Miss uh, Jamie Charlie. So, who won? It's really about who could show up at an event unclockable. The winner of today's compact challenge is Ashley. <gasps> Congratulations. Two challenges in a row, baby. Now, Miss Ashley not only won the compact challenge again for the second week in a row. But then she turned around and won the whole challenge, the whole drag, so congratulations. Which to me was, it, it was the best look. I just don't know if it was a drag look, but with that being said, I don't know. But yeah. Everybody just kind of grazed over a drag look, but there, I don't feel like there was anyone who was like, wow. But no, yeah, Miss, Miss Ashley is really out here killing it. So, um, but everyone did a, a, a great job. I'm impressed. What can I say? So far, the challenges have been, I would not guess, I can't wait to see what's going to happen with all the other challenges for the rest of the season. I wonder if there's going to be a season two. Anyways, these are just my quick thoughts on Insta Influencer episode two. Please go check out the rest of the series and come back every Sunday for my next review. And also, like I said, don't forget to come back on Wednesdays for the new show, Nelly Bill. So no more Nelly and Eddie. It's going to be Nelly Bill on Wednesdays and continuing on with the Instant Influencer Review on Sundays. If you haven't already done so, go ahead and click the big red subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up because I know that you liked it and go ahead and click the post notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. Don't forget to watch Insta Influencer every Friday on James Charles' channel and go follow all the creators, all of the artists that are on there because they're great. They all have YouTube channels. They have great social media. Follow them. They're great. Wonderful, wonderful, very talented influencers and artists. I will see you in the next video. Wah! Bye!